expect from a Jenna Hayes show at Blush? The hottest thing you've ever seen. <laughs> that about sums it up right super there. I naughty, buy it. Super naughty, super fun, um, very flirtatious, interactive with the crowd, you know. I'm not one of those girls that goes on stage and like just kind of struts around. Does the motions and then disappears until no, the next time. No, I love dancing and it shows, you know? Yeah, good. Do you have a background as a dancer? Is this something you trained at and worked at? Is just you just did it as you go, just naturally talented, figured it out? Um, I danced one day as a house girl when I was 18 years old and it was really a difficult task. <laughs> yeah. Um, the club was brand new. It was a day shift. I didn't make any money. <laughs> it came in. I had bruises all over me and I was like, I, I can't do that. I went up on stage like 12 times in one day and didn't make anything. So oh. I was like, I can't do that. I went back to waitressing at the time and then ended up getting into adult. And uh, after being an adult for a couple of years, you know, my old boss, Jill Kelly, was like, you have to start dancing. Like, you, it, yeah. it's good for promotion. It's good money. It's good exercise. It's just good all around, you know? Yeah. And I was like, I don't know, I don't know. And then finally... Plus, get you out, travel the country, see places, yeah. meet fans, interact with fans. And I was unsure for a little while, but finally they convinced me to do it. And once I did it, I loved it. And I realized that it's a little different than house dancing. I only have to go up one or two times a night. Yeah. You know, and sign autographs in between. You're only there... Fans. Well, not only are you there for the big crowds, you draw the big crowds to come yeah. in and see you. There's no chance you're going to go up there and it's just going to be an empty house because people are going to come to see Jenna Hayes. Yes, and I'm not just up there in like a bikini or something. I have like, you know, themed costumes and stuff like that. I get to pick my music and interact with fans and what stuff What kind of music like do you go with? Um, I usually do one rock set a night and one hip hop. Just the other day I released um, the first movie that I'm just directing. I'm not performing it. Mm -hmm. I released that through my company. It's called Meow Too. It's okay. really awesome. It has 14 girls in it. It's just unbelievable. Getting great reviews. Everyone's buying it. Flying off the shelves. Knowns, awesome. unknowns, girls in the movie. Girls Wolf. you discovered. Or? Wolf. It's got Christina Rose, Alexis Texas, girls that are known. Then it's got newbies like uh, Isis Taylor or um, Jaden Cole. Um, oh god, there's so many girls. <laughs> like Skin Diamond, Misty Stone is probably my favorite scene in the movie. Um, just beautiful, gorgeous girls. Yeah, sounds good. Meow too. The name of the movie. When's it coming yes. out? Um, it's already out. It's already it's out. out. Go you buy it. Go buy it. Go buy it. <laughs> if you could just do anything, what what would it be? What is your dream gig? Well, I'd love to get some small roles in some comedy movies. I had a small role in Superbad, and I also had a little cameo in Crank 2. So I'd like to do more of that kind of stuff. Mm -hmm. um, I'd also like to be in scary movies, because they're my favorite. I'd love to be the girl who gets killed or plays some <laughs> psycho or something like that. And um, I love G4 Channel. I've done stuff with them before. Okay. So I'd like to do more for them. And, of course, Spike TV. I find myself watching Spike TV a lot, even though I'm a girl. <laughs> and I'd like to be on that show. So Excellent. On some of their shows and host something for them. I don't know. 